The White House COVID response team says if you've been hesitant to get vaccinated, now is the time. At a briefing today, they detailed the toll the Delta variant is taking on the unvaccinated and urged Americans to do their part to stop the pandemic. Our Dr. Frank Me George here now with the highlights of what we heard earlier today. Doc. Yeah, Karen and Devin, so as a nation, we are once again heading in the wrong direction. Cases are up nearly 12% over the last week, and deaths are up 23%. But with the Pfizer vaccine now fully approved by the FDA, there is new hope that more Americans will have the reassurance that they need to get vaccinated. We know that there are Americans who have been waiting for the FDA process to be completed before getting a shot. For those Americans, the wait is over. The COVID response team urging more Americans to get vaccinated and calling for more mandates to require it. As we have said from the start, we need everyone, governors, leaders of educational and healthcare institutions, employers, small and large businesses, and all Americans to do their part to defeat this virus. The push comes as national sampling of U.S. hospitals shows the unvaccinated remain at high risk. COVID-19 associated hospitalization rates were 17 times higher in unvaccinated shown by the blue line compared to vaccinated adults shown by the green line. 98% of the samples tested in the U.S. are now from the more contagious Delta variant. If you are unvaccinated and ready to revisit your decision to get vaccinated, or if you still have questions, talk to your physician or a trusted source to get the information you need to get vaccinated. And as the battle continues over masks in schools, the Surgeon General said he is bothered deeply by efforts to block safety measures. I think we have a moral responsibility to do everything we can to protect our kids as they go back to school and try to learn the way kids are supposed to do. And that means that we've got to make sure that schools have mass requirements. Now, the surge in the South is having an impact on vaccination rates. In fact, six million Americans got vaccinated in the past seven days, which is the highest ever seven day total in more than a month and a half. Back to you. Which is showing some movement. Exactly right. All right, Doc.